Aloha everyone, Max with Asian Geek Squad. Today, a quick review of the Pitaka Mag AZ Case 4 for the Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra. This case retails for $70, a link's in the description below to support our channel. All right, if you are looking for a thin case, you have to check this out. Barely adds any weight and check out how thin it is. All right, let's go ahead and take a quick look around. Small cutout there at the top. Here on the back, we have this camera housing to protect the cameras. This is the sunset color, looks pretty cool. Here on the bottom, cut out for your charging port, speakers, and your S Pen. Because the case is so thin, the S Pen is really easy to remove. Quick look here in the front. This has a slight lip along the top and the bottom, so you're okay to put your device face down. However, if you're prone to getting your screen scratched, go ahead and get a screen protector. Here on the side, half of the frame is exposed. Here on the other side, half exposed as well. Volume up and down rocker and power button, really easy to push. All right, well, if you are looking just to put a case on your phone, but to maintain the slimness, because the phone is slippery, definitely check this out. Really nice. Now let's go ahead and try some MagSafe accessories. First, the MagSafe charger. All right. And it's stuck on there pretty well. The MagSafe battery pack does cover a little bit of the third camera, so be careful with rectangle accessories. And you can see there it's slightly lifted along the top, so not a strong grip on the MagSafe. Let me try my favorite MagSafe accessory, my wallet. Alright, so because it's slightly lifted here, it doesn't have a strong of a grip. But for normal usage, it will definitely stay on. And finally, let's quickly try my strongest MagSafe accessory. This shouldn't go anywhere. So when it separates like that, it isn't this magnet, it's this magnet. This is, has a really strong MagSafe magnet and I've tried other MagSafe cases and it definitely does not move. So in this case, I think for normal usage, it's okay. If you wanna pair these two up, great. A, you can put a decent amount of pressure before the phone separates. So you would really have to bump into something for the phone to come flying out of this magnet. Moment of truth, $70. For me, it's a little bit too much for $70. I think I would personally wait for a sale for this case. And yeah, still solid, still a great case. All right, quick video for today. Thank you guys for watching. Aloha.